What's up guys? Welcome to Primetime Polton. I'm your host comic book writer Mark Polton. Today we have a new unboxing video. Um, I've said it before, Zack Ryder is one of my favorite wrestlers, if not my favorite wrestler. Uh, he recently got released by the WWE. He's going by his real name Matt Cardona now and he's already got his first action figure. Uh, he's part of the Micro Brawler series from Pro Wrestling Tees and I have one and we're going to open it up and check it out. Alright guys, so Matt's figure actually came with a uh, Pro Wrestling uh, Tees uh, crate box, um, but it sold out so fast I wasn't able to get it, but I was able to find someone on eBay selling the figure, so I jumped at it, got it at a good price, I'm happy with it. Um, so this is Matt Cardona um, as part of his uh, podcast uh, series, Major Wrestling Figure Podcast. Um, they do a... Uh, I guess it would be called a bit stomp in paradise, uh, based on, uh, Kurt Hawkins, AKA Brian Myers. Uh, as a kid, he combined the stomp figures and thunder in paradise called it stomp in paradise. So, uh, Matt and Brian, they each have their stomp in paradise identities. This is Matt's it's pretty cool. He's got the beret camo gear, the, uh, urban camo for the pants, his water pistol. I really dig it. In the following month, uh, Pro Wrestling Crate, uh, Brian Myers' figure will come out. Uh, again, I wasn't able to get it uh, because of it, it selling out so quick. Uh, so maybe I'll check eBay. Uh, I was more concerned about getting uh, Matt's figure. So I have a, I've opened uh, some other micro brawlers in the past. Uh, so you know what you're getting with these. I really uh, like them. Uh, they're, they're cute and uh, they stand well. Um, and, and for what they are, I think they really have some nice detailing on them. We're going to open him up and uh, inspect it further. Alright, so I have him out of his package. Looks great. Good detailing for the muscles, for the camo. The boots, you can even see the laces on them. Good detailing on the water pistol, the beret. I like how they even have the little like fold or crease in the beret where it flops over. This is cool, man. Uh, I have a feeling they're going to do a regular edition mat. Uh, probably once this whole pandemic's over and Matt signs with someone. Most likely AEW, I would believe. Um, but this is really cool. I give it a thumbs up. Uh, I'm a fan of the micro brawlers. Uh, you can check Pro Wrestling Tees store out. They won't have this available, but they have other micro brawlers available. Some good wrestlers. Um, and it's just a great uh, store to support your favorite indie wrestlers. Buy a t-shirt, a micro brawler, a hat. Anyway, uh, this is my unboxing video and review. Thanks for watching, guys. I'll see you next video.